Hey Mr. Davis, this is a temperature detector I built with the pickaxe microcontroller and a 10K NTC thermistor. And here's how it works. Alright, let's try the circuit out. Plug it in, and now I must set the potentiometer to right where the LED comes on, and then I have to do it right after it goes off. And there, and then I'm going to hold the thermistor, and my fingers are warm, so that the LED will come on. There, it came on. It measured the rise in the temperature. Now, the temperature shall fall, and it shall go off soon. There, see? And this can be helpful. You can put it to any in spot and you can put it like there and then when it gets if it gets much colder the LED will go off and the same is you can put it all like all the way over there so if it gets much warmer then it will eventually come on that is the same kind of idea that is in a thermostat and the output of the LED is from pin 4. That is the output pin 4. And the potentiometer, its input goes to pin 2. on the pickaxe and the thermistor goes to pin 1 and on the pickaxe and by the way for the thermistor and the potentiometer I am using the read ADC command which is the analog to digital conversion. And this resistor here is the pull down resistor for the thermistor. And this resistor here is the current limiting resistor to the green output LED. All right, this is the flow chart for my temperature detector. Alright, now you see the two blocks. Read ADC1 B1 and read ADC2 B2. Those are the two blocks telling the pickaxe to read analog to digital conversion of the thermistor and the potentiometer so that you can turn the potentiometer and then you see B1 is higher than B2 that checks to see if the potentiometer's resistance is larger than the thermistor's resistance and if so it outputs the correct output LED and then later farther down you see B2 is higher than B1 that sees if it goes back down so it can turn the LED off. Thanks for watching. Bye.